In today's video, we are going to show you how to fix the unrecognized game client cannot continue error that pops up whenever you are launching your favorite games like Fortnite, Sea of Thieves, or Far Cry. Follow along and we'll get you back in the game fast. Let's begin. Now, the most important part here is to close the game in Epic Steam Launcher. All right, so you want to right click on the Epic Games launcher, entirely click on, um, quit on it, or the Steam icon in the system tray and select exit. Make sure no background process of the game is running. You need to check the task manager and try to restart your PC if that works. And then if you are using the Epic Games launcher, I want you to go to the game that you wanted, go to the library, right click on it and click the verify that's one way you should be able to see a three dots icon on the game that you wanted try to click the verify and that should be able to fix that simple issue now if you are using steam for your specific game i want you to go to the general settings and then go to the installed files from here there is an option that says verify this game's files are installed correctly you just have to click the verify integrity of the game files and what will happen is it will update on its own most of the time it will fix any problem in loading the easy anti-cheat setup another option that you can do is go to the installed files i want you to click the browse because that would forward you to the the steam apps i want you to click on that folder and then i want you to click the common go to the games for example you are having problems with the easy anti-cheat on Rust, I want you to click on it, click the easy anti-cheat folder. There should be a file or an application that says easy anti-cheat underscore setup. It is an executable file. I want you to right click on it and there should be a, an option that says repair as service. What will happen is this will fix any missing or corrupted easy anti-cheat files. All right, so that's one of the easiest way. After doing that, you need to restart your PC and click the run as administrator. Okay. And then another option that you can do is now while at it, I want you to right click again on it. And there should be an option that says properties. And then go to the compatibility section. And then you need to click the run compatibility troubleshooter. All right. Because as you may notice, if this program isn't working correctly on the version of Windows, try running the compatibility troubleshooter to see if that works now i want you to pay attention because you need to click this section right here that says run this program in compatibility mode for all these windows you have windows 8 until 10 or 11 and, and then you have the ability to run this as administrator you want to make sure to check that option or check that option and click the apply and okay another option that you can do is go to the services on your windows all right and as you may notice you have the services here i want you to look for the epic games or epic online services you need to do the same thing that we have done earlier right click on it go to the properties and you want to make sure on the startup you click the automatic delayed startup or automatic all right and then click the service starts click the apply and click on ok by updating your windows and drivers now if you are using nvidia you might want to go to the nvidia g experience and if you are using amd you might want to go to the amd adrenaline make sure both your graphics drivers are fully updated because outdated system files or gpu drivers can conflict with eac and cause the integrity violation error and that's also similar to the uh, windows you might want to go to the systems or settings and then there should be an option that says update and security and click the windows update similar to the gpu drivers make sure your windows updates are fully up to date all right of course you can also try uninstalling and reinstalling the easy anti-cheat itself by going to the official website and there's also an option here as you may notice that if you have any concerns about EAC, you can read through the support articles covering the most question and answers, all right? And of course, you might get some answers and troubleshooting steps from here. Now, 
you need to update or temporarily disable security features if you are using a firewall some settings can block the easy anti-cheat i want you to add the game and the easy anti-cheat to the exceptions list if needed briefly disable firewall for now test, test the game then re-enable and then you can also do the same for your antivirus because sometimes you know outdated antivirus settings can block the easy anti-cheat update your security software add the game to the exception list if needed again briefly disable the antivirus test the game to see if that works so these are the steps on how to fix the unrecognized game client cannot continue error if this video helped you do not forget to hit the like button, share with friends, and subscribe for more quick fix guide. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next video.